Thank you for joining me for your look at sports. Busy day of CMU athletics with a number of teams in action, including the baseball and softball teams playing doubleheaders. Before we get to the Mavericks, you know we have to start things off tonight with play of the week. Two great plays from the soccer pitch as well as one from the baseball diamond. Let's take a look at this week's nominees. And the first play is brought to you by Ramos Law. Tuesday night soccer under the lights between Fruta and Central. Second half game tied 0-0 when McKenna Shenna crosses the ball into the box. Warriors can't clear it. Collected by Kenna Salietta who turns and buries it in the top corner. The freshman scored the only two goals of the match, moving her total to five this season while lifting the Wildcats to a 2-0 victory. And play number two features the same two teams, except this time on the baseball diamond. Top of the seventh, Fruta leading 9-2. Jet Wells delivers. Lewis Kuhn smacks one up the middle, but look at Mason Lopez laying out to make the stop. Hops back up to his feet and gets the runner out at first. Lopez and the Wildcats have been on fire for a month now, winning their last eight ball games, including two against their Southwestern League rivals this week. And our third and final play from the Western Slope also took place in Tuesday's Fruit of Central match. Late second half, Warriors still trailing 2-0. Evelyn Brown collects the ball, fires one on net. But are you kidding me, Jasmine Hernandez? What a save from the Central goalkeeper to keep her team in the fight. The senior goalie pushed her save total to well over 130 after Tuesday night's stellar performance. And voting for this week's edition of the Play of the Week will open later tonight on our website. If you at home capture a play you would like to nominate, please email the newsroom with the description of the play along with the video. 